John and little dude back. Hello. We're moving on to the band boxes. And somebody wants to start with the anime box. My favourite. So this is the anime box for May. And we have some paper. We have that bit. So, automatically, I'm going to say they're basically like jammy dodgers and strawberry flavour. Uh -huh. What do you think from the picture? Yeah. Yeah, so they are looking very much like jammy dodgers. Um, what we call them in the UK anyway. These are product of... I'm not sure where they're from. Um, Indonesia. So they're from Indonesia. So we'll go straight in and open these. We'll go straight in and cut these open. <laughs> and they do look just like mini jammy dodgers. And I can smell the strawberry already. They smell, it reminds me of like the butter biscuits you get, like the Danish butter cookies. The okay. biscuit reminds me of that, but definitely smell the strawberry. So yeah, definitely like a butter cookie stroke, shortbread almost, but they are nice. So I can see them being eaten quite quick because they are nice, aren't they dude? Yeah. The next ones are peach flavored sweets. Mm -hmm. These feel like they're a hard sweet. They would do. I, I hate to say it, but it smells like paint. Oh, yeah. Right. They're not as hard as I think they are, a bit softer than they all look. Mm. And these are supposed to be peach flavour. They're nice, you can taste the peach. Mm. A peach. Um, a chew some jelly peach. Mm. And this is from Korea. Um, not sure which one, because it just says KR. I would imagine North Korea. We need to try. No, sorry, South Korea, because I can't see North Korea having things that you'd be able to get all over the world. Really need to travel to another country and try some so, new things. What I'll do is put a little bit of tape on the back of this to seal that. And this is always the longest video as well because of the snacks that are involved. Um, I'm going to get a cheat sheet as I am not always up on what these things are. Everybody should have got some sort of sweets looks like they're all peach and the biscuits which is cool because to me that's perfectly fine the autograph which is coming later i think someone's gonna be very happy so the card is number 381 of 2500 the artist is sean langley and it is all for one from the hit series My Hero Academia. So that is the bad guy. All for one. Mm -hmm. I do like that, that looks cool. 
we have a sticker again this month. Another big one. Which is... Inui Yasha. Not sure who that is, but sticker looks cool. <laughs> the pins, the standard pin is from Code GS, Code GS, GS. I'm not sure, and that is Lelouch. Um, Suzuka. And Charles, I believe. Um, the other out of 50 would have been that one, but black and white. Um, well, not black and white, but like a purple and white, purple outline. There is a monthly giveaway. Um, horror prize. Um, geek, gamer, some different prizes there. Look cool. I won't mind that. Signed. Ghostbusters. Proton. Projector. Whatever it is. Can't remember what it's called now. Thought that was cool. I'll save this bit because somebody doesn't know about the autograph. The art print, the first one is 1442 of 2500. And that is from artist Ashley Riot, who was a new artist. And this is Black Clover. Never heard of it, but I do like that. That looks a really cool art print. Yeah. This one is number 258 of 500. That is the variant version. I still think that is cool. That is awesome. I like that one as well. Yeah. And. Um, Not the one I would have wanted because somebody would have preferred the other one, but I would be up for a trade. This lady is Cynthia Kranz, also known as the Amazing Cha um, Chi Chi. Mm. What show is that from, dude? Dragon Ball Super. Yep, yeah, and the lady voices. The lady. Oh, and I've dropped it. She also voices people in Detective Conan and One Piece. Um, the one I would have liked is that one there. Dragon Ball Z poster. That one there, dude. I think you'd like that one more, wouldn't you? Mm. Yeah? Yeah. Or do you like that one? I do like this one. You do like the one you've got? Mm -hmm. I personally, I think you would like the other one with the Dragon Ball Z on it, but mm -hmm. you know who the character is because you recognise the show straight away. This is mine. It is yours. Who's the man that she's with? Because I know nothing about anime. Who's that? Is that Goku? Yeah. That is Goku. So I've learned something. I realise it's Goku, being how many figures we've won. <laughs> mm -hmm. So that is everything that's in the box. And I'm assuming you're very, very happy and want to have them in your own collection. Yep. I don't know who the girl is, Dad. So what I will do is we'll put these back in there. The girl? Mm. That's there. The amazing Chi Chi. That's no, who the girl voices. I mean, on the show, I've never thought of one. Oh, the show. okay. Well, I haven't either, so it's no good asking me. Mm -hmm. So that's your autograph. That can go in there. Yep. That will stay with that then. Is that I meant to be a tattoo? That's a sticker. sticker. That's a big sticker. Uh -huh. So we'll put all them in there. Do you like everything that's in there? Yeah. That's all yours then, mate, yeah? Yeah. 
so I get nothing out of this anime box. <laughs> but to be honest, I don't mind because he realised what the autograph was from. He knew most of the shows, some I don't think he has seen, but he recognised the character of Goku in there. And he liked it and he wanted it. So we'll put that over there. That's yours, mate. Yay. So that's that. Definitely, I think that's a 5 out of 5, 10 out of 10, whatever you want to call it. Mm. If it was a 20 out of 20, I would do 20 out of 20. So this is days like this I like where he's happy, he's, he likes everything that's in there. It makes it worth getting that box, even though I don't know anything. He wants everything that's in that box. So I'm happy with that. So thanks for watching. Bye for now. Bye.